Hey everyone, this is Neil. I know that job interviews and presentations can be terrifying and I've seen people literally freak out beforehand and I'm here to say, don't do that. Watch this video and find out why not. So here are my three tricks on what you can do before a job interview or before a presentation. So trick number one is picture the event beforehand. So what you can do here is close your eyes and picture the room or the space where the presentation will be or where the job interview will be. And then what you can do is picture yourself at the presentation or at the job interview you know, think about what clothes you'll be wearing. Imagine yourself standing there in a very confident way or sitting there in a very confident way. Picture yourself speaking in a very friendly, relaxed and confident way. And then also picture the people in front of you. So at the presentation, picture the audience. Create a picture of them as being enthusiastic and friendly and interested or create a picture of the interviewer or interviewers as being interested and engaged and enthusiastic in what you're saying. The trick with this one is the clearer the picture is, the more colorful the picture is and the bigger the picture is, the more likely that this picture will help you on the day of the presentation or the job interview. So my trick number two is positive self-talk. So self-talk is the voice or are the thoughts that you have in your head, like the running thoughts that you have in your head all the time. And this trick, what you do is you basically engineer positive thoughts or positive self-talk, or you pick the positive ones and you go with them. So for example, at the job interview, when you're looking at the interviews in front of you, engineer positive thoughts. So say for example, oh, she looks very professional. I think I'd be very happy to work here. Or he looks very friendly. I'm looking forward to doing this interview with him. Or if it's at the presentation, even before the presentation begins, look out at the audience and try to find positives. You know, look at them and say, oh, this is so great. The, the, the atmosphere in the room is, is very exciting. Or these people have all come here to listen to my presentation. That is awesome. I'm very excited about it. Or look at that audience, you know, think to yourself and say it to in your head. Look at the audience. They look so enthusiastic and interested. This is going to go great. And then my third trick is to pick a mantra. So when you say that, when you talk about mantras, sometimes people think this is related to like meditation and spirituality and, you know, some of it is, but a mantra is just also like a very, very simple and practical way, you know, a very simple and practical sentence that you can use on the day to stay focused. So, you know, you're going to be nervous and perhaps sweating a little bit and even sometimes like you know, some people, their hands would be shaking or they feel very uncomfortable. So you need like a very simple mantra to keep you focused. So a mantra that I use is enjoy this or remember to enjoy this. So when I'm feeling very nervous, I keep repeating in my head, enjoy this, enjoy this, enjoy this. And it just helps to keep me focused and actually to enjoy the experience. Another mantra that you could use would be stay calm, everything's fine, or everything's cool, stay calm, everything's cool, stay calm, everything's fine, or it's all going great, and just repeat it. It's all going great, it's all going great, it's all going great. So any mantra, any simple sentence that you think on the day will help you, and then just write it down beforehand, look at it, and then when you're feeling a bit uncomfortable or a bit nervous, repeat the mantra in your head. So I hope these three tricks will help you in your job interview and your presentation. If you use them, make sure to tell me about it and give me some feedback. If you found the video helpful, like it, share it with your friends and colleagues. Remember to subscribe if you haven't subscribed already and please turn on the notifications button so you'll know every time we upload a new video, which is usually every Wednesday. See you soon.
Hey guys, thanks a lot for watching the videos. If you're wondering what you can watch next, well, you could watch more vocabulary, you could watch more grammar videos, or you could watch more videos explaining typical German phrases. Simple. Enjoy.